Hello and welcome to Rustic Play's Fears to Fathom, Home Alone, something I've had plenty of nightmares about when I was a kid, and now we get to play out those nightmares. Uh, for those of you who don't know, this is an episodic game about people who basically submit uh, stories about creepy stuff that happened to them, and they make a game out of it. So there. A bunch of episodes out already, but I just downloaded this one, so that's the one that I'm gonna try. Okay. What happened? Did it freeze? Yeah, there we go. Episode 1. Home Alone. July 12th. I didn't want to put this up on Reddit just for it to be called a piece of fiction. I don't even know where to start. Excuse my lack of good storytelling skills. Also my lack of punctuation. I guess I'll just start. Well, the it was the middle of the summer. This is very slow. My parents had left for the weekend due to a work trip. Uh, which meant that I was all by myself for the weekend. Also, I feel like I do have to mention that my sleep schedule was really messed up around this time. I would sleep and get up at just about any time of the day. You didn't have school, like, so I did plan on fixing that. Well, you've got your own room, so... I woke up at around 8 after a nap that evening. Space to get up. Okay, well... This doesn't look so bad. I think this is happening in the 90s or 80s. You know, judging by the... Um, VHS grain filter and the fact that he doesn't have a computer on his desk. Well, this looks like a nice cozy neighborhood. the room okay let's see can I run no I cannot Man, this house is huge why do it oh, oh okay well I'm sure this will come into play later uh, three messages from mom let's see what mom says uh, Okay, so wait. When are you guys going to gonna be back? Dad and I are gonna be back on Monday, honey. Didn't I tell you that yesterday? Take care of sleep on time, blah blah blah. Uh, can I invite Mason and Josh over? Of course, call me if you need anything. Take care. Okay, what are the new messages? No need to order anything. Already made you lasagna this morning. Check the fridge. Nice. Oh, that's nice of her. Okay, Mason. What is Mason saying? I'm inviting him over to play Mario Kart, so I can't promise we have plans with Nat, of course. We have to choose between a girl and Mario Kart. Always pick Mario Kart. Mario Kart is life. Uh, I'm gonna assume this is another bedroom. Don't ask me why, but I went straight to my parents' room. Well, I'll tell you why I went to the parents' room, because... oh. Shit, that scared me. Because I don't know the layout of the house. I didn't even know I was going into the parents' room. Okay, I can't see shit. Is, that, is it better on the capture? Okay. Can I hide in the closet? No. And this house is huge. And completely unguarded. I never understood this whole American picket fence, like white picket fence, like out in the open, just wooden door house, like, this is so easy to break into. Oh, I can go outside. But I can't leave the porch. Well... 
This is like way too many corners, way too many places for somebody to hide. What is this? It's a nice backyard. Oh, this is so dark. Do I get a flashlight or something? Back door. Okay, let's get that lasagna. I am hungry. Food was cold. G to throw. <laughs> so I can just throw it somewhere? Can I can I put it in the oven? I can! Okay. Uh, well that's getting ready. Let's explore the rest of the house. What's that noise? Is that the oven? to crouch <clears throat> oh it dinged okay I'm not gonna food was nice and hot I like watching TV while I ate okay I'm not gonna I don't want to leave this door open so I'm just gonna close it although I don't think that's gonna do anything because again like a wooden door will not stop anybody okay you can just kick it down Let's sit down and uh, relax and eat some lasagna and watch some TV. What are we watching? Is it the trailer for the next episode of Fears to Fathom? Well. Oh my, am I gonna eat the whole tray of lasagna? What am I, Garfield? This thing is huge! You ate the whole thing! Oh my god. I was already feeling very sleepy after eating the food. Yeah, I would too. What the fuck? Oh, it was the TV. Yeah, let's just throw it. Yeah. I'm sure somebody will fix that. We'll clean it up. I'm gonna turn the volume down in my ears. Because I'm pretty sure something's gonna jump at me. That door was closed. I specifically remember closing that door. Hey, when I have, uh, we're gonna have to call it off. Um, something just came up, uh, but you gotta come to Jessica's tomorrow. Okay. Can I message something to you? No, I cannot. <laughs> Okay, uh, back to the door that is now mysteriously open. I'm gonna just scooch back a little bit because I'm playing this in front of a giant TV. If something pops out, I'm gonna have a heart attack. you not lock the door like and this is the part I don't understand like you maybe it's just growing up in a different part of the world but like us when our parents left ho left ho us home alone we would lock everything up and we were one of those uh, what do you what do you call them like latch and key kids where your dad would just tell you like okay like lock the door behind me and don't end don't open it unless you hear that it's me This is not annoying at all. What's happening? Okay, so somebody is basically in the house with me right now. I'm sorry, Miles. Got to see you tomorrow. So my name is Miles. Oof. Can I turn off the light? No. I 
can't even lock my door. This is awesome. Well, might as well do some homework while I'm at it. Twelve thirty-eight a.m. I did homework. I got done with homework for the day in about a few hours. Oh, it's a nice little touch that they actually added scribbles to the thing now. Okay, it's now past midnight, and somebody's in my house. And don't stay up too late, kids. Um, I sh. I shouldn't get to hear from Mrs. Paula this time. Chill out, dude, all good. I'll probably just come back to bed after camp. Okay. So should I sleep? Yeah, it's past midnight, probably, right? Oh, this is this is not fun. Like, I don't know if you noticed, but I hate horror games. I don't. Okay, that's not true. I don't hate horror games. I hate horror games where you are defenseless. I got up to get some water. This kid is so fucking brave. Like, I've never... Like, I wouldn't even turn off the lights if I was a teenager or a kid and I was alone in this gigantic house. Are you kidding me? I wouldn't leave my room, first of all. Second, I would have all the lights on at all the time. The fact that this music is swelling, like, is not giving me... <sighs> I'm not even gonna go into my parents' bedroom. Somebody outside. Okay. Yeah, that's some refreshing sip of water. Let's throw that away, close the door, and check if somebody's outside my door now. Like my heart is pounding right now. Let's just get back to my room and go back to bed. Close the door. Was there somebody standing outside and I just didn't notice them? Uh, Miles, who's at the door? You there? Okay, just reply something to her. How do I reply? Oh my god, somebody's at the door. Do I go out? What do I do? I'm not leaving this room. Are you fucking kidding me? Quick to hide. Oh yes, exactly. Hide. That was like the best decision you could have made. Somebody gonna barge in like oh, this is this is such a bad time like I swear. Is he like what am I doing? Like text her back. How do I text her back? I don't know. Okay, like I don't hear any noises. Oh god. Did 
Do I go out? <clears throat> oh, no, 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 no. I'm hiding, I'm hiding. I'm hiding back. Okay, just from the perspective of the game, like mechanically speaking, like I'm sure there's a trigger somewhere, like once I step over it, something's gonna fucking pop out at me, and I don't wanna do that. So I'm just gonna try to figure out if I can text her back. There's space to get up. Do I have to get up? Oh God. We're calling the cops. Okay, I'm going back to my room. Don't answer the door, I'm not going to. Back to my room, back to my room, back to hiding. Okay, okay, okay. Lock the door, get back under the bed, and hide. Oh, this is so creepy. Like, this is like a wait, like a. This is like exactly my nightmare when I was a child. <gasps> okay, he's inside the house. I'm not leaving this place anymore. I'm just gonna stay under my bed. Okay. So did he break in or is he ringing the doorbell? What's happening? Like, what do I do? Do you hear me? Do you hear her? It's Paula at the door. Mom, so sorry, honey. Everything is going to be all right. You told me not answer the door and now you're telling me to answer the door? Which one is it? Is it even my mom texting me? Like, or is the guy just took her phone and... Paula? I, I heard the floorboards squeak. I'm, I'm not going out there. Oh, shit, 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 shit. She keeps ringing the doorbell. What do I do? Oh fuck 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 Close the door and hide 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 He's like right outside my door This is a very bad Okay, so she told me to open the door to go to the nate. <gasps> the cops are here. Oh, thank God. Police? Oh, I made it. Okay. Let's go. 
open the door. That's it. It just closes it. Okay. Um, so that was very, that was very intense. Uh, but I am curious about one thing though. What happens if he catches you? Let's see. Alarm, lasagna, TV, eat the whole tray by myself, throw it away like a barbarian, homework, sleep, water, gulp, 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 creepy guy at the door, don't answer the door, hiding, 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 class breaks, he's inside the house, and now the door is gonna... Paul is gonna come, yeah, and now Paul is here, so which means he's gonna pop out and jump at me when I try to open the door. Do you hear it's Paul at the door, Mom? So sorry, honey, everything's gonna be okay. Okay, so this is the part where I die. Okay, I'm gonna just lower the noise in my ears. Wow. <laughs> Fuck. I didn't expect them to walk through the wall. Well, thank you very much everybody for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. I might play some other episodes of Fears to Fathom. Let's see. Uh, but don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.